Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got Colors by LaRoe, The Mighty Red Baron, and I'm going to stamp it with gold. I started off with Starting Over by American Classics as my base coat. And here is Colors by LaRoe, The Mighty Red Baron. Beautiful red scattered hollow. Lovely. So I'm going to go in with my first coat. Love the brush on this. Love the formula. Colors by the Road just really, really knows their stuff. They've got some great polishes. It's just yummy. Luscious. Very easy to work with. I'm going to cap my free edge here. Looking pretty good. Hi Woody, how you doing? <laughs> and now we're gonna go in with our second coat of the Mighty Red Baron. I've had this polish for a while. I don't know how long it's been out, but um, I just was looking through my drawer and this one jumped out at me. So we plopped it on today. Beautiful. And I'm going to top this with some of the Pro FX Quick Dry Top Coat. You can see how much of a difference that makes between that ring finger and the other ones that already have a top coat on them. Just brings out that shine and that shimmer so well. That hollow goodness. Being sure to cap that free edge again. And got to break out Woody again. I am a messy painter. There we go. Just gorgeous. And here's a swatch photo of it all on its own. I'll be using this Pro Collection XL02 from MoU London, my Bundle Monster slash Maniology Monocle Stamper, my Clear Jelly Scraper, and the Born Pretty Gold Stamping Polish. Here we go. So I really liked this image, like the double knot. I just, I love it. Woven, I don't know. But I'm gonna use this on my pointer finger, middle finger, and pinky. And I'll be using another image on my thumb and my ring finger. I am gonna try to get up this uh, excess stamp and polish with some tape. It's not coming up so well. So, you know, some of them do better than others. And a lot of times I think it has to do with my condition of what's going on with my skin. So we're going to go in and do that same image again. I really like this one. I think this is the one Randy wanted to see me use. So Randy, if this was the one you wanted to see, you know, there you go, girl. <laughs> and this is the image I'm going to use on my ring finger. I also used it on my thumb. It's kind of like a scalloped look. Let's a little bit more of that base color pop through. So definitely wanted to do a little something different. And then back to the woven look for my pinky nail. There we go. Ta-da! And I'm gonna go in and do some cleanup with some acetone and my cleanup brush. It's getting, a, getting kind of tricky. There we go. Got to make sure to get up under there because with my nails being short, I definitely get a lot of polish up under my finger. been a while since I wore red like this, so I thought it was about time. There we go. I'm going to top this one with some posh top coat and call it to done, to did, ta-da. I love when you put top coat over it, how it just brings it to life. Makes it so shiny, so glossy, so pretty. Make sure to cap my free edge. So I would love to hear what you think about this manicure. Please leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think about it. I do have a swatch photo coming up here pretty soon. 
and uh, that is it. So I hope you enjoyed it. I want to thank you for watching and until next time, be good to yourself. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.